Okay, so we are going to switch to uh, Knights of the Card Table, which is hopefully going to be far more entertaining, um, way less of a bummer. Uh, Knights of the Card Table is not on Twitch, so game and games and demos it is. Boy, that sure was something. What does this button do? Oh. Okay, cool. Alright, we can fix things. Where are you? Let's go down, move you over. And let's go back up. There we go. Uh, okay. And begins. Surely the mystical world of to be named. <laughs> That's cute. Click on the bouncy gold key of skulls to start the game. I mean it. Start your request. All right. So what we got. We got. Okay. There's some missions. Cool. Uh, there's an expansion island. What's this? I'm gonna assume card forgery? Yeah, okay, so you can forge cards, or... Uh, okay. Wow, this is super duper a mobile game, huh? That got made into a desktop option? Uh, is it super framey for me? I definitely dropped some frames at some point, but it seems okay now. This actually reminds me of a different game um, that I have on my phone. Hold on, what's it called? Meteor Fall. I am curious if Meteor Fall and this are made by the same people. Anyways, let's click on the bouncing key. Yay, how to play. Kill things. Tap the card you'd like uh, to engage with. Doesn't even have to be the card in front. If the card is a monster card, you will die and will away the monster's hit points. If the monster card is defeated, you will earn gold. If failed to defeat it, and you suffer damage. Alright. This is a low level monster. Stronger than, uh, it's stronger than a rock, a rock and weaker than a rock with a knife. Just don't roll one. Okay? I did it! Drag cards around the player in or, uh, to reorder them. The order you play them uh, in could mean the difference between great glory and sad ride home with mother. <laughs> okay. Power milk. Uh, okay. So I can go like this. Okay. Okay. Health drink. The source missing health equals the health stat. Okay. Uh, may also be smashed for gold and general awesomeness. Okay. So. Yeah, give me all that free stuff. Depending on using three cards of the same type in a row will grant a bonus. Uh, okay. Bonuses are good. Okay. 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 Normal monsters. Uh, slightly tougher variation of the easy monster. Take care not to take them for granted. Alright.
Okay, hard monsters have to plan things out. Get a streak going effectively, okay. For it seemed like good currency. Uh, okay. Uh, okay. Save some of the pop. Okay. Okay. Uh, okay, so I can lock better weapons here. Takes unlocks on the second level. Oh, okay. It probably takes two away from your roll. Okay. Okay. Oh, you can unlock. Okay. Neat. Wow, this game's got a lot going on for it, huh? Shave for gold. Gold and pot will increase the further you descend into a dungeon. Okay. Uh huh. Uh huh. What's this? Oh, that was an unknown card. Neat. Perfectly healthy. Oh no! How dare! the milk blue. That's concerning. Alright, I've unlocked the sword. And money. Okay. Heat levels turn into delicious pops. Uh -huh. Okay. Uh, okay. So now... Let's just try using it. Just to see what it's like. Tapping your hero will swap between your equipped weapons. Do equipped weapons go to the forge? Okay. No, absolutely not. Oh yeah, look at that. Minus one. Oh, that's what the sword does. Okay, is that like every time? Yeah, okay, so I can negate the effect. Huh. Okay. Uh, main dungeons have multiple floors. Okay. What's this? Some dungeon multiple floors. This revelation leaves you aghast. Truly, this world is well designed. <laughs> Cute. Wait, why did that do f What? I don't understand why I'm rolling fives and then it's rolling to one. Why? 
Why am I minusing? Okay. I'm gonna stick with my knuckles for the moment. Unlock Shieldy. What's that do? You're going dying as often. 3% chance to dodge. <laughs> okay. I can't wait for the difficulty spike on this. Uh, yeah, missions. Great. Again, I rolled a four and it became a one. I don't get it. Why? <laughs> I've gotten further into that cave. So you made that jump that I couldn't make? I take a Pokemon Freak. You found a different path. Oh, okay. a new person. Uh, okay. Let's try a new person. Yeah, what, is, what do you do? Stick a move. Plus three cook. Okay. Yes. Let's swap to them for now, I guess. So poison bad. Poison is sure to sap the strength. It's green and gross. Okay. One, two. There we go.
Hmm. Wait, you found a different way to get further? Oh. Guess I wasn't paying attention. Oh, right, Professor Rule's lawyer. There's now that should have been granting rewards between levels. I looked up the line, I guess you're right, maybe. Okay. Okay, that's kind of cool. It's an interesting game. I'm just kind of waiting for the other shoe to drop. It's got quite the tutorial arc on it. Uh, spell tomes. Spell cards are one-time use cards that cast one of six different magical whatchamacallits. Okay. Oh, interesting. That's neat. Can I buy pops yet? I don't know what any of that does yet. Magical powers are unleashed! Uh, frozen enemies will have to thaw before they can attack. Okay. Which means I now get like a free swing on them, right? Yeah. Okay. I have all kind of pops, I don't know what to use them for yet. I'm sure the game will tell me at some point. Like... Maybe some of these require... Oh yeah, so better weapons require pops. So they're the premium currency of this game. Doesn't seem to be a way to buy them, for whatever that's worth.
The writing on it is something, though. Uh, poison. Critical dodge. Both weapons have a small chance to deal critical strike. Okay. Also, you must heal. Let's get critical as long as you can. Oh, God. Shields give you a chance to completely dodge an enemy attack. Okay. That's a lot of beefy monsters. Oh, it carries over, huh? That's good to know. Rocket dog. One, two, do this for the bonus. Okay, let's negate that. I'll take that. Oh no. Oops, that's not what I wanted. Can you go back and play previous levels and like score better on them, perhaps? Firehole percentage? I'll take that. Oh, that's so many things. Jesus. You made the jump, so it's it is doable, or do you require something more? Like I said, it's simply a matter of me being bad at it. You need to do it differently. Oh, how do how does one do it differently? Need to grapple on the way up so you swing up, up and over. Oh, that makes a lot of sense. Yeah, yeah. So you swing yourself. Yeah, okay. Momentum goes both ways. You say, boss monsters. 
Keep tabs on the lower level monsters that have some serious lasting power. Uh, beware of their increased health scaling as you splunk deeper and deeper. Okay. Is it good? <laughs> Found this other path first. Yeah. Oh, excuse me. Oh. oh, wow. Okay. Where was the other path? Did I just walk right past it? Kinda. Where right, to go back? Can't go back. Unlocked the mace. I'd have colorful things to say about the jumps. Yeah, probably. Okay, so what does this do? Takes two away from your roll, unlocks after level 11. I, mean, I guess we can give the mace a try. <laughs> you certainly did. Yeah. Oh, what time is it? 11.39? Alright, one more and then I think I'll call it on this game as well. Oops. Great miss. Oh, okay. Return to map. Huh. I don't understand what minus two off the roll means. Does it loop around? Oh, right, no, I swing for minus two. So you have to, like, compensate for it. Right. Brass Knuckles are still doing a lot of work here. Oh my god. Just keeps going, huh? Okay, well, I think that's going to do it for uh, Knights of the Card Table. I think I'm alright with it. I, th I think I've, I've, I played, what, like, a dozen or so levels there? I think, yeah, that's great. Yeah, alright. Not bad. Not bad, though I am curious. I'm just gonna look something up here. Pony Wolf, what else have you done? It's the card table, skip chaser. Oh, this person's done a lot of games. Like a lot. Holy crap. I wonder if there's something about the art.
Hmm. Huh. The art reminded me of another card, like, card building game called, um, Meteor Fall, which I have on my phone, which is a very good game that I'm very bad at. Because, like I've said before, uh, deck building games are not my strong suit. I like to play them, but I'm bad at them, and I never quite get through them. It's kind of the reason I stopped playing Magic's the Gathering, to be honest. Um... Anyways, uh, next to the card table. Okay. Um, it's okay. It's okay. Um, I like the art style. Um, it is an interesting mechanic that you can just swap cards. Like, you don't have to take the card that's coming up front, so you can actually plan your moves a little bit. I think that's really interesting. Um, I'm wondering if there's abilities later on to be able to, like, reshuffle like what you're dealt. I think that'd be a cool ability. Um, I don't quite get the point of the other weapons because they subtract off your roll. So you have to compensate for them, which kind of doesn't feel great when you can just use the brass knuckles and just add bonus to your attack. Um, maybe that's just the big brain move, but uh, it was okay. I mean, if I wanted to, I could probably get through that game in a stream or two. I've just dedicated going through it, because there's a set number of levels, right? And I can't imagine them having that much. Um, I can't imagine the difficulty spiking that much. Mind you, I did play through that golf, mountain golf game, and the difficulty certainly spiked at points then, too, so who knows? Um, overall, yeah, it's fine. It's not bad. Um, it absolutely feels like a mobile game. And that's... In this particular case, I, that is not an insult. Um, whilst I have opinions on mobile games, that one absolutely feels and plays like a mobile game. And quite frankly, I think it would work very well on a phone. The controls are simple. It's snappy. The game is difficult enough to play whilst the controls being simple enough that it, it strikes a good balance. Um, I'm not super stoked on the writing. It felt a little like a hello fellow teens for my liking. But uh, yeah, overall, not a bad game. Don't really have much fancy to say about it. It's, it's fine. Um, yeah, I think that's going to do it for me tonight. It's 11.45. Very, real, very, very realistic GM, though. Yes, I will give it that. Um, the GM's just doing their best. Um, yeah, that's going to do it for me tonight. So we tried a couple games. You know, we tried uh, the grapple game. What was it called? Silver Grapple? Um, which is a very good game. That's not my style. Uh, we played The Space Between which was trying very hard to be very philosophical about stuff that I just couldn't care about because the experience was terrible. Um, and nice to the card table, which is just a just a solid little card game. Card, it's not even a deck builder game. It's just, it's just an interesting card mechanic kind of game. Uh, next time Spaceport Janitor? Yes. There's a reason I didn't grab Spaceport after I went through the Space Between. Because Spaceport Janitor, I think, is something I will definitely play probably next Wednesday. But I'm going to start the stream with it and just kind of play through it. Um, because I, th I, I have the feeling it's going to be that kind of a game. Much like Overland, where I just, I played Overland through, uh, for the entire time, and it was good. Um... Like it was worth do it, just dedicating the one Wednesday to it. I have a feeling the Space Fort Janitor is going to be the same thing. And I want to give it its due. So. Tonight I purposefully wanted to try and play chunks of smaller games. Um, just to get a little bit of variety. Um, and to try out my, my fancy stop start recording button. So I can, instead of having to edit the video and clip it and do some weird stuff, I can just like click. And then it cuts it and makes and starts a new video. I should probably integrate the BRB into that too, because that'd be useful. Um, but yeah, that is going to do it for me tonight. Uh, thank you for watching. 
I will be back on Friday with more Mother 3. I think we're almost done chapter 7. I hope. Chapter 7 has been the longest thing. Um, but yeah, that's going to do it for me tonight. So, um, yeah, thank you for watching. Until next time, stay safe, have fun, wear your goddamn mask, and I will see you later.